Hello everyone. We are the Detecting Smiths. Smiths. Alright guys, we got a new permission that I may have mentioned in my last video. We got a an old lot here. This house was from the early 1900s, maybe even into the late 1800s. Um, house is now gone. It's just kind of an empty lot here on the Mississippi Gulf Coast. So we're going to get at it and see what we can find. Mama's called me over here. She found her first coin for the day. What you got there? I wasn't sure. I, I saw that it looked different. I wasn't entirely sure. But I could see on the back where oh, that's it's... that's a week. Where... Oh, shoot. <laughs> it's... I mean, it spelled out one cent. And, and I saw that, and I was like, wait, this is... That's a week. This is something. I'm like, I'm finally... I finally found something that's neat. That's a metal detector's... N old. Favorite cereal. How old? What's the date on it? That's what I was going to ask you. What, um... What years were these made? Uh, I think they made wheats up into the mid 50s, early to mid 50s. I can't see a date. Maybe once we get it cleaned up, we can look at it. All right, good deal. Let me know if you find anything else. Okay. All right, guys. I've been digging a lot of trash, a lot of pennies, and I just dug this out of this hole here. It was probably about six to eight inches deep. I've never seen anything like this. Looks like maybe some sort of button. I don't know. I'll get it, try to get it cleaned up and uh, see if, well, first thing I'm going to do now is find it. There it is. I'll get it cleaned up. I'll try to take a closer look at it. Anybody knows what that is? How about uh, dropping a line in the comments there? This right here was like two inches. Two inches under the soil. Looks like a... Fishing lure or something? I don't know. We'll get that cleaned up. We'll have to do a little research on that. If anybody knows anything about that, let me know. All right, I got a signal right here. Let's see if we can maybe pop that out of there and see what's in here. Well, I'll be. Look at that. <laughs> There's a tire hanging there. Hey, Mama. I got another car. Oh, did you? Yeah. Little red. Looks like a little red Corvette. <laughs> little red Corvette. <laughs> All right. Uh, been digging a lot of trash. Dug a couple of pennies, but I just pop this out of the ground right here. Some sort of key. A national key. So I guess that's a national key. A key to the nation. On to the next hole. I'm thinking I got something good right here. Probably gonna be an aluminum bottle cap, but we're gonna do a live dig, see what it is. Well, probably gonna be in an aluminum bottle cap. I'm just imagining. What is it showing up as?
mid 80s to low 90s. And I think that's what it is. Hold it. Oh, that looks like an old can. Is there any sausages, anybody? Probably. Yeah. All right. That was a letdown. <laughs> okay, I just had this signal was ringing up in the mid 60s, around 64, 50, 65, 66. I flipped the plug. I see something right here. Don't know what. Oh. I do know what that is. Oh wow. This is one of my favorite finds. UMC Company. Club number 12. Got quite a good collection of these things. I want to build a display case for nothing but just Head stamps, that's, I really like to find these. Cool find, but I think there's something else in the hole. Let's see what else, see if we can pick up anything else in here with the pinpoint. Well, maybe I was mistaken. All right, everybody, this is our wrap up from our last dig on our permission. Here's all of our trash. Uh, a lot of it even got some sidewalk chalk. Why'd that ring up? Nothing. <laughs> um, and I, I got to looking at this. I thought this was going to be uh, a little red Corvette, but it's not a little red Corvette. That is a little red Ferrari. But you sang your song. Yeah, that was a freebie. Uh, we got a few a drawer pull, a uh, little hook. I'm not sure what that is. Some really cool square nails. This is probably the largest square nail I've ever seen in my life. Um, and we got the the national key, the key to the nation. You remind me later, and I'll Google the number to the White House. I'll call them and tell them where it's at. Mm -hmm. Somebody obviously lost it. Um, a couple of these Purex lids. I thought those were kind of cool. Uh, and my wonderful head stamp, UMC Club, Let's number see if 12. Let's mm, Yeah, okay. Uh, don't know what these are. Some tiles. Mama found a marble. First marble while digging. That That's pretty cool. Of course, we found some clad pennies. One clad nickel and one 1944 no mint mark wheat cent. And that's all we found. Um, we'll go back to that permission again. We still got a lot of trash to dig out of there. So we can hopefully get to some of the good stuff. So uh, I appreciate all y'all's support. Appreciate everybody watching our videos. And hopefully we'll have some. A little more cool stuff to show y'all later. Oh, by the way, I, I, I skipped over this. I'm not sure what this thing is. Uh, it's got a little hinge on it right here. and Got like a clip. I wonder if that's some kind of thing that clips on a pocket or something. And it's got a little stone in it right here. If anybody knows what that is, how about dropping it down in the comments and uh, help me out. Maybe I can... Uh, learn a little something from this object like i said i appreciate y'all support i appreciate y'all uh, watching our videos and uh we'll see y'all on the next video thank you okay everybody it's been a while since we dug on this permission um i learned a lot from working on this permission uh, we had a lot of fun what little bit we've done so far of course i don't know that we're through with this permission but we are learning. We're new to video and we're new to YouTube and and we're making mistakes and we're learning from our mistakes. Uh, the biggest mistake that we made on this particular 
hunt uh, was we took all of our finds and we showed them to the landowner and the landowner wanted to keep them and of course we were you know we were fine with that but after we drove away and got down the road mama and I realized that we didn't do a wrap up before we gave the fines to the owner so uh, that was our mistake but uh, this is a two-day hunt what I did was I combined two days into one video so the things that we found on the second day's hunt we were able to provide a little bit of a wrap up on that but it, it was a lot of fun and mama found two wheat pennies her first and second ever wheat pennies hunting with a metal detector her first one was a 1919 and the second one we're not sure but it looked like a 1911 it was in pretty bad shape but we had a lot of fun and we've learned a lot from it uh, sorry it took so long to get another video out uh, we've had a lot going on in the family but uh, i hope you can understand that um, i'm going to try i've got some more clips but uh, i got to put together we're going to try to get at least one video out every other week and we hope that you guys enjoy them if you haven't already please hit the subscribe button like our video if you will and we will try to continue to create videos and hopefully over time they'll get better and better but we appreciate you and we appreciate you watching our videos thank you <laughs>